Tri-State mother is waiting anxiously by the phone tonight, praying for the news that her 18-year-old daughter has been found. Madison Bell left her home to go to a tanning place in the Highland County town of Greenfield yesterday. Her phone was found inside her car and the keys were in the ignition. Local 12's Tessa DeTiro spent the day in Highland County where hundreds joined in the search. Madison Bell was supposed to be celebrating her high school graduation this week. I've shed a lot of tears and sometimes I haven't shed any because I feel like I've just cried everything I have out. All of the friends and neighbors out searching tirelessly in the rain for Maddie are bringing her family some comfort. It makes me feel so much better because that's my baby. We have uh, crews that are distributing flyers and we've hit most of Highland County, Fayette County and Ross County and we're starting to work in Pickaway County this evening, and we've even sent flyers as far south as Portsmouth, Ohio. Many volunteers are fellow Greenfield McLean classmates. She's a good girl, she's amazing, and she doesn't deserve anything like this at all. And I, I hate that she's going through it and she's alone. So I'm hoping we find her soon so that she doesn't have to be out there by herself anymore. Some have never even met her. I've got a daughter. If she was missing, I would want anybody and everybody out here looking. More than 300 people came out today to search for Maddie. And between last night and today, 4,000 hours have been spent on the roads and in the woods looking through Highland County. The volunteers say they're the best people to do it because if something was off on the roads or in the woods, they would be able to tell. Anything out of the ordinary, any kind of broke twigs. I mean, it could have been just tractors, but we still stopped and looked just to make sure. Maddie's mom, Melissa, says she hasn't slept, wondering what happened between the country corner market where Maddie was going to tan and the church parking lot across the street where her car was found. But there's been reports from witnesses that it had California plates on it. There's been reports from witnesses that there was a tall white man, late 20s to early 30s, that they saw there. She just wants her daughter home safe. Mama's gonna fight. I'm gonna fight for you so hard, like I always have, until you get home and I'm not gonna stop and I'm not gonna sleep until you're home. In Greenfield, Tessidy Tiro, Local 12 News. The search will start again tomorrow morning. The State Bureau of Criminal Investigation, Sheriff deputies from Highland and Ross counties, as well as Greenfield police, they are all working this case.